My mouth looks so dry, y'all. Please excuse the way I look right now. Queen of food, this some work. This some work drinking this. I had to burp, excuse me. What's up, everybody? Please excuse how I'm looking right now. I am literally just getting out of the bed. So today I am making the kidney liver flush. The kidney liver flush is supposed to be made before you have breakfast, and I just rolled out of the bed. Literally, I did my meditations and got about the bed, y'all. So <laughs> it's time for me to break my fast. So I'm gonna have this kidney liver flush before I eat anything today. So last year when I was doing my Sacred Woman fast, I was doing it incorrectly and I kind of wanted to show you guys the correct way because I learned the correct way watching a video from Queen of Fua. You always want to do this on an empty stomach before you eat anything. The ingredients that you will need is either the colon ease that Queen of Fua has or you can use cold pressed olive oil. You need some cayenne pepper, just a little bit, and you will need a garlic clove or two. I believe you need two. Yes, two fresh garlic cloves, and you'll need the juice of either a lemon or a lime. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go ahead and juice my lemons. I do not want you guys to go out like I went out my first time. So I was like, maybe I should show this because if I made this mistake, there's a chance that other people have as well. All right. So here is the juice of my lemon. Now we're going to deal with the garlic clove. A little longer than a few minutes later. much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. All right, that took a lot of effort. Yo, that took a whole lot of effort, but make sure you peel your garlic. And it also says to crush it. I think I should use a bigger knife, child. It's a little scary right here. Trying to make sure I crush them. Make sure you crush your garlic. And we're gonna take everything and now we are going to go to the lake. All right, so now I have everything together. Y'all not gonna be able to see my face because I need to do this. But you're gonna need two tablespoons of either the cold press olive oil or the colon ease. I'm gonna go ahead and do two tablespoons. And now we're gonna need the juice of either a lemon or a lime. Go ahead and pour that in there. So then you're going to take the garlic cloves that we peeled and crushed. You're going to plop them into the water. And it says a pinch of cayenne pepper. So I'm just going to do one shake. Now we're going to add eight ounces of water. Blend 
here is the kidney liver flush. All right, my mouth looks so dry, y'all. Please excuse the way I look right now. Here I have my kidney, kidney liver flush and I have my mucus strip drink. It is a different color today because when I went to the grocery store, I bought Moro oranges. Learn what Moro, Moro oranges are. And I am just going to try it in the juice. I have not, I repeat, I have not tried to just eat the orange. So I'm a little nervous about what my mucus strip drink gonna taste like. But I'm not too nervous because I feel like I kind of have an idea. But yes, Moro oranges are like purple in the inside. Let me show you guys. I did not juice it all the way, so don't talk about me, okay? I'm a little scared of what this is going to taste like, so just bear with me. Um, but do y'all see that? I was scared when I opened this up and then I looked at the name, like the name that was on the sticker, and I searched, researched it and there are oranges that are this color. That goes to say, please do not underestimate the grocery store and reading your labels at the grocery store. You will definitely find a lot of different fruits. Fruits do not all taste the same. Different names taste different. Like there are a hundred, there are hundreds of different apples. Like there are different kinds of apples. You got Pink Lady, you got Fuji, I believe it's a Gala apple. You got Honey Crisp, which is my favorite personally. You got Granny Smith apples. There's hundreds of different apples that you could just like, you know, try different apples and see how different fruits taste. But yes, no more rambling. I am scared to drink this, you guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. Haven't had this in a year. <laughs> let's just and I haven't had it the right way so this is my first time drinking it the right way first time the right way cheers if you're drinking this with me don't forget to tap it on the counter I had to burp excuse me <laughs> oh it smell like garlic y'all okay <laughs> Thank you for the lemon. It's like sweetening it up. If it wasn't for the lemon, I don't think I would be able to do this. But the lemon kind of makes it sweet a little bit. but it's sour at the same time. Mm. Mm. Y'all. Woo! Queen of food, did some work. Did some work drinking this. Every time you feel like you don't wanna finish it, just remember that this is going to help you cleanse yourself out. I'm speaking to y'all and myself. Just remember that this is going to help you get your system nice and clean and rejuvenated. Get all those toxins out. Help you be more, a more light being. Period. Just remember that, please. I got just a little bit more. Oh, hell no! One more, one more chug.
The mucus chip drink, y'all, hands down, is one of the best drinks in the book. I will have a video coming out, and I'll show y'all. The mucus chip drink. So good. So good and fresh and natural tasting and all that. No sweeteners, no nothing, just pure fruit and the sweetness from the fruit. The moral orange kind of gives it a raspberry taste, if that makes sense. Like, I don't like raspberries, but it gives it that nice balance between orange and raspberry. Um, it gives it a really good taste that way. I like the mix. I don't like it straight. I like the mix. I love Chaser. Okay. Alright, I'm probably going to wait 20 minutes to half an hour before I eat, but I'm just going to have some fruit. I hope you guys like this. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and turn on those post notification bells so you know every time I post. And don't forget to comment if you have any video requests, any questions, or you just want to talk to me because I be bored. But you already know it's your girl Candy G in the place to be, so comment down below and I can see for sure. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Without a doubt, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.